Hi guys, this is Lance again and welcome to Runtime Recruitment, another unboxing. I've been waiting for the Udo 86, Udo 86 board. It's taken quite a while, they've had a couple of problems with it. They had a couple of, uh, and a couple of setbacks. Um, so it was a bit delayed, but anyway, we finally got it. So this is a bit of an unboxing of the different components. So here is the actual single board computer. It's an 86, very powerful. I think there's a quad core. I'll have a look at that in a minute. Then we've got this pack here, and we've got a case. We've got the case. We've got the. We've got some. We've got a HDMI cable. We've got a power cable for the storage because I bought some storage with this, which is this thing here. This is um, SSD storage, it's 128 gigabytes, and there's obviously a SATA connector as well. So we're just going to unbox this. Um, let's, let's just put that aside for a minute. Let's look at this. So this is the actual box, and I haven't opened it yet, so I'm going to do it right now. So let's have a look. How does it come apart? Oh, interesting. How does it come apart? Oh, okay. It's got to come apart this way. Yes, definitely got to come apart this way. And there it is. So, let's have a look. Um, so, let's, we can cut this open. Let's just get a knife and do it. So, there you go. So, there it is. That's the... Um, not sure what that is actually. Um, that's some sort of a sensor, maybe. Yeah, I think that's a sensor. Let me have a look at that in a minute. So, this is the actual board. So, let's have a look. Let's open it up. And voila. So, Obviously that's the real-time clock battery, lots of different ports, I'm not quite sure, I think that's the SSD slot here for the memory, SD card, there's some RAM here, some, some RAM, and if we turn it over, obviously that's the CPU, and you've got the standard ports, you've got the USB ports on this end, and you've got... HDMI here and I think this is also mini HDMI another USB port Ethernet some expansion ports that might be there that's the SATA the SATA connection so you can actually connect external hard drive to it as well uh, power I don't think there's an audio jack that might be the audio jack actually there yeah, that's for the headset. So, so that's what it looks like. It's been a while getting this. Speakers, it says here. So these are speaker outputs. This front panel. Uh, there's an infrared, infrared receiver there, looks like. There's quite a lot packed into this particular unit. This has also got an Arduino built into it as well. There's quite a lot of... This is quite a compact piece of kit and we'll be firing that up later on. So I'll put that aside for a minute, put it back into its anti-static bag. And uh, I'll have a look at this later as well. Um, let's just take this out and have a look at, have a look at it. Uh, let's have a look at what this looks like here. So it looks like a sensor of some sort. That thing there looks like an optical sensor. It does say sensor on it. Yes, it's a light sensor. So this is a light sensor. And so this is all part of the kit. So anyway, put that back in here. And we'll be connecting it all up a little bit later. So put that aside for a minute and let's go to the other bits and pieces in here. So if we open this up, and I think this is the power supply, 
looks like a power standard power supply yep power supply nothing fancy there yeah look this is the SSD it's 128 gigs 6 gigabit transfer to gigabit per second transfer rate and this is what plugs in and we'll be plugging that in later on when we boot up the board so that's that HDMI cable standard HDMI cable branded Udo and we've got the case so that's quite nice I'll be putting that together a bit later and you got your SATA and I don't know what this is actually let's have a look this might be some memory actually it looks like some memory yeah no, no, no. this is the this is the uh, Wi-Fi receiver unit so yeah so this is your Wi-Fi module because um, you got your antenna there so that's your Wi-Fi we'll plug that in later and of course you got all the um, you got all the screws and nuts and bolts for putting the case together so that's kind of it really I'll put that back in here so that's just a quick unboxing of the Udo 86 board um, and of course I'll be putting it together and and then uh, we'll be booting it up and with the software I, the software is already burnt on top of it so so I'll just show you the board again there it is the beast there's a lot here there's a lot to this unit and so we'll be we'll be powering it up very shortly so there you go Udo 86 this is really the next generation of Udo the Udo originally brought out uh, an earlier version which was less powerful than this this is a x86 one they had an an ARM one before so this runs Windows this runs Windows this runs Linux and also it can drive up to four monitors independently so you know for the size of board it is it's a full-fledged computer that you can carry around with you if you want to and or it's great for a maker board for a very powerful maybe for you know image processing or uh, maybe number crunching of some nature signal processing or, or, or whatever and you can use it for whatever you want really so very versatile or a music station or whatever you want to do with it there's so many different applications and so you can run Windows on it and you can run Linux um, on this as well so I'll be powering it up at, at some point so I look forward to that video cheers